Joe is great with children. That's why his hands are always doing little bunny foo-foo. <laughs> Brian motherfucking Moses, and this is the Rose Battle League. Tonight, it's LA versus Austin. Joe Urell versus Mike Eaton. If you like shit talking, if you like verbal assault, this is the show for you. Let's start the fucking league. I don't give a damn about the critics. This guy coming to stage from Austin, Texas, by way of LA. Make it loud for Mr. Mike Eaton. Uh, my name is Mike Eaton. I'm from Austin, Texas, and I fuck shit up. The best part about roast battle is that you don't have to pretend to be nice to get people to laugh at it. You can just be an asshole. Mike, you're battling Joe Urell. Joe's in a, in a wheelchair. Why are you trying to go to hell? Listen, I don't do it often, but I'm ready to eat a vegetable. <laughs> Folks, make love for my favorite crip from Los Angeles, Joe Urell. He's going first in this one. You may go first. <laughs> I was gonna rock paper scissors for it, but that feels like cheating. <laughs> It's funny that he thinks his reflexes are faster than mine. Uh, oh, but if I pull that battery out, I'll beat you in a race. <laughs> doubt it. Damn right, everybody. This is what makes Rose Battling great. Two consenting adults, Rose Battling. Los Angeles, Austin, Joe, Mike, let's Rose. Here we go. What up? Joe is a brilliant guy, I'll give him that. He has two degrees. In fact, the only thing he struggled with was walking the stage at graduation. Thank you, hungry, hungry hipster. Joe. <laughs> Mike actually went to all boys school where he was really popular because he had the best tits. <laughs> That's amazing. It sounds like the speaking spell's dying. Uh, <laughs> Uh, Joe looks like you left a handsome guy in the dryer. Mike, nobody thinks you own a dryer. Uh, <laughs> well, I know Mike. why your pants have no wrinkles. <laughs> I, I, I'm especially good with the iron, but, um, <laughs> but yeah. you know, Mike's mom is a devout Christian, which makes sense, because the Lee Church gives her a son she can believe in. Thank you, really limp biscuit. Keep rolling, rolling, rolling. <laughs> hey, you know what? Calm down, sugar, but you're about one bear claw away from me. You want to be yourself, so... Uh, uh, I know, the only thing slower than your voice is my metabolism. Uh, <laughs> As you're uh, circulating. <laughs> Uh, Joe is a painter and he names all of his paintings, keeping his birth parents a, a tradition of naming unwanted pieces of shit. The only drug Mike won't do is eat shrooms because they're a vegetable. <laughs> I ate half a grand before the show. Fuck you. <laughs> They're legal here, I think. Uh, <laughs> uh, you wouldn't guess it by looking at him, but Joe is great with children. That's why his hands are always doing little bunny foo-foo. <laughs> that was a good book. That was a good book. Um, Mike is a motivational speaker. He motivates women he speaks to to get a safety escort to their car. <laughs> Thank you, Reptard. <laughs> Reptard! Reptard! <laughs> you know, getting to know Joe, he's had a tough life. He's an alcoholic that was adopted, and he has cerebral palsy. I asked him how he has the courage not to kill himself, and he said, At least I'm not a woman. <laughs> It's weird because it's like my family was still more functional than uh, uh, Mike's failed marriage. Speaking of uh, his ex wife, you know, he thought she was the one when she ate his ass. And I'm just glad somebody in the house was tossing a salad. That was five. Let's fucking go! Joe, <laughs> you around. That's Mikey. Make, make one more big round of applause. I'm going to go to my judges. This was no, incredible. Yeah. This was so incredible. Oh my God. I thought it was 
so freaking funny, and I'm just like honored that I got to see it. But I have to give it to Joe. Yes. Yeah, Jamie. Which uh, Sasha Baron Cohen character did you? Yeah. <laughs> uh, I mean, this is one of the best roasts I've ever seen. Yeah, this is fucking it's incredible. Like the yeah. Most incredible. It's so hard to choose. And I mean, besides the jokes with all the tags and yeah. the intro and after you guys wrote like 20 fucking yeah. jokes and <laughs> all of them were good and i also love how supportive you were of each other my, my favorite part about how supportive you were of joe is you were making fun of him for being slow and then in between hit hit a joke and you'd go let's go like you were rooting for your team yeah. at the special olympics uh so that was <laughs> awesome be a real pussy if the only Austin person I didn't vote for was because he was going against someone in a wheelchair. So let's go, uh, Mike Eaton. I'll go, Mike Eaton. Let's go. Oh, Both of you guys were incredible. Thing. Mike, you fucking oh, killed shit. it. Uh, this was an outstanding battle. You both look like ventriloquist dummies for completely different reasons. <laughs> wow. <laughs> yeah, you look like Pee Wee Herman if he got caught jerking off in an Arby's. <laughs> wow. Holy shit. To the menu. They'll never catch me. <laughs> Uh, honestly, the whole way through, everybody was hitting. Everything was cool. <sighs> Believe it or not, I edge it very slightly, and maybe I'm a little bit biased because of the things he hit in the opening. He had two knockout punches yeah. before it even started, and maybe that's not fair to include, but subconsciously, I'm d I don't know. I, I think Mike edged it just a little bit. Wow. Just a little bit. Let's go, Mike. Doesn't happen often, but this guy beat Joe Urell. Keep it going for Mike Let's Eaton, go. everybody. Yeah. Hug each other, bump each other. I don't give a damn about the critics.